Let's discover the male and female church in Iloilo City. And let's try the signature dish in Western Visaya. Also, the Filipino-style wonton soup here in the city of love. What's up guys? So today is our flight to Iloilo. So excited na ako. Yeah! Let's go to Western Visayas. Yeah! Alright, we are here now at the airport. Yeah! Entrance gate. Pasok na tayo. It's good dahil 2 hours early tayo before our flight. Dapat laging ganun. Okay, check-in muna tayo. Let's bound to Iloilo. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! Okay, window seat tayo. Mga biyero, ang bayan ng Iloilo ay matatagpuan sa Visayas at ang Visayas ay nahati sa tatlong bahagi, ang Western Visayas, Central Visayas at Eastern Visayas. At ang bayan ng Iloilo ay matatagpuan sa Western Visayas, sa isla ng Panay. Wow! Ang Panay Island ay nahahate sa apat na probinsya. Ang probinsya ng Antique, Aklan, Capiz at Iloilo. Oh! And the province of Iloilo is famously known as the heart of the Philippines. Since it is located in the middle of the archipelago. Wow! And its capital is Iloilo City. And Ilongos are famous for being soft-spoken and sweet. That's why it is called the City of Love. Wow! And it only takes more than an hour flight from Manila to Iloilo. Alright, lipad na tayo. Let's fly! Grabe, kita-kita ang buong Metro Manila. Wow! And now, we are on the top of Taal Volcano in Batangas. Yeah! Buracay Island wow! And now Antique Yes Welcome to Iloilo. Baba na tayo. Yeah!
Yes, City of Love. Alright, touchdown. Iloilo International Airport. Yes! For our first destination, Haro Cathedral. Let's go! Ganda guys, solid. Meron siyang hagdan sa harap ng simbahan. Haro Cathedral was built in year 1874 with a Romanesque revival style of architecture and it is also called as the National Shrine of Nuestra Señora de la Candelaria or Our Lady of Candles where she sits on the top of the stairs of Haro Cathedral which is the reason why it is a remarkable church because of the stairs in front of the church leading to the image of Our Lady of the Candles So tara, sakit na tayo. So here, you can see the Haro Bell Fry on the other side of the road and it is the another reason why it is unique because the bell of the church is on the other side o oh, nasa kabila Solid! Sabi nila, noon daw ay yung bell fry ay ginamit bilang watchtower So tara, let's go inside So here, all of the saints in the two pillars are male That's why it is called the male church o lalaking simbahan. And sabi nila, if you are wishing for a husband, this is the church where you can pray for that wish. Alright, it's time for KSTJ. And in front of the church is the Haro Plaza. It is a children's playground and park. Here, you will see giant statues of dinosaurs. Kung saan magugustuhan talaga ng mga bata. Alright, dahil nagutom na ako. Let's have our breakfast. Here, in Ted's Old Timer, Lapas Batchoy. Lapas Batchoy is a signature dish from Bisaya. And it is originated from the district of Lapas in Iloilo City. Wow! Yeah! And here is their menu. The Old Timer Favorites and Old Timer Originals. So for me, the special lapas batoy. Hmm. Hmm, ang bango at ang sarap. Grabe guys, dati sa cup noodles ko lang to natitikman. Ngayon, legit na. Yeah. Grabe, dami ng serving nila. Let's eat.
Alright, on to our next destination, ang Molo Church. Let's go! Ilo Ilo Esplanade, yeah! Touchdown, Molo Church, also known as St. Anne Parish Church. Wow! One of the most beautiful church in Western Visayas. And it was built on year 1831 with a Gothic architectural design. Wow! So guys, trivia lang. Ang Molo Church is made of coral rocks. As you can see guys, ayan, looks like corals talaga siya. Wow! Alright, let's go inside. Molo Church is a feminist church or female church. Because there are 16 female saints inside the church, including Saint Anne, the patron saint of Mola Church. At dati daw, dumaan dito ang ating bayani na si Dr. Jose Rizal. Noong August 4, 1896, noong pabalik siya ng Maynila, galing Dapitan, Mindanao. At ito ang sinulat niya noong pumunta sa dito. Alright, case TJ na yan. In front of the Molo Church, you will find the Molo Mansion. Molo Mansion, also known as the Yusai Consing Mansion. One of the most outstanding historical homes in the Philippines. So inside, there are different food stalls. So refresh muna tayo dahil nakakapagod maglakad-lakad. Yeah! So if you go to Iloilo, don't forget to stop by here. Kagaya ng Haro Cathedral, Molo Church has its own playground too. Siguro, sinadya to para sipagi ng mga bata na magsimba. Alright, let's try naman ang sikat dito na pansit molo ng cup isings. Yeah! And this is their menu. They have empanada, fresh lumpia, puto, biskocho, at marami pang iba. At syempre, hindi pwedeng mawala ang pansit molo. And here, they also sell frozen products of pansit molo balls. Wow! Alright, andito na ang order natin. Yeah! Pansit Molo is originated from the seaport in the town of Molo where Chinese tradesmen introduced wonton soup to the area and the locals started to call them Pansit Molo. Oh! A Filipino pork dumpling soup. Let's try!
Alright, maglakad-lakad muna tayo dito sa Riverside Boardwalk. Ilo-ilo Esplanad. The Ilo-ilo River Esplanad has two parts, Esplanad 1 and 2, and it is connected by the Carpenter's Bridge. And it has an overall length of 9 km. Kaya maraming nagja-jogging dito every morning. and afternoon sa hapon and here meron din silang pedal boat ride wow! where you can cruise in the whole esplanade solid Tara, check natin. Ayan, marami silang pedal boats dito. Pwede yung group of four or six maximum kung pamilya kayo. Then ipapajak nyo lang. At nag-range siya ng 85 pesos per person. And 48 naman para sa mga bata. At meron din 20% discount for PWD and senior. At dito nyo rin makikita ang I am Iloilo signage. Yeah! I-KSTJ na yan! So, eto na ang dulo ng esplanad sa may Carpenter's Bridge. Ang nagdudugtong sa Esplanad 1 and Esplanad 2. Wow! At marami din nang ingisda dito sa May Carpenter's Bridge. Alright, dahil nakakapagod uli maglakad. At tara, kumain uli tayo. So here, you will see the beach of Iloilo City. Let's go! So ayan, it is a beachfront restaurant or alfresco dining. Tara, let's check the beach. Grabe, ang ganda. And the island that you can see in front of us is Digimaras Island. Yeah! 
and this is their menu they have starters and specials they also have vegetables and noodles and syempre hindi mawawala sa kanila ang fresh seafoods dahil ito ang specialty nila Yeah, ang ganda ng view. Dito lang yan sa Breakthrough Restaurant. Here in Iloilo City. Yeah! So if you are visiting Iloilo, don't fail to dine in at Breakthrough Restaurant. Yeah! Alright, ito na ang order natin. Ang big oyster. Yeah! Let's eat! Thank you for watching guys. Please like and subscribe for more travel vlogs here in Iloilo City, the city of love.